Hey everybody, so this weekend I went to New York. Went to New York to a meet up with my homegirls, aka my sisters for life. My flight actually left at 6, 10 a.m. I was at the airport by 4 o'clock. TSA was crazy. It took me 45 minutes to go through TSA in Orlando. It was absolutely crazy at 4 o'clock in the morning, but I made it, okay? I was a little nervous because this was my first time ever taking a trip by myself without my husband, but it was extremely fun. This is me waiting on my homegirl, Tommy. Um, New York was big. Hey, Tommy. New York airport is extremely big. We decided to take the subway and the bus versus a Uber to get to our hotel, and it took us two hours. We did the bus, and from the bus, we went on the subway. I was like, oh, my God. With the suitcase, y'all, but we made it. Um, this is me at Times Square. Times Square, it was snowing that Friday. So, listen, I just want to take some selfies. This was my first time actually touching snow, y'all, at the age of 40. This is the subway right here. We were trying to basically figure out where we was going. Thank God for Tommy because, listen, we would have just got lost. Keisha, like, don't record me. <laughs> This is the subway right here. Let me tell y'all, I saw two big ass rats. I was like, oh my God. Protesters, I don't know what it was doing. ABC News, they was actually filming. And I was like, hey, the man was like, hey. This picture right here was from the inside of our room. I was like, let me take this picture. It was beautiful. This is how we purchased the cars to get on the subway. And on the weekends, some of the trains are actually closed which we didn't know. Um, this is me just taking a picture. This is the subway again. Now we decided to just explore the city, you know. This was the Apollo. I was like, New York. Okay, y'all, I can't see. Anyways, me rubbing along. <laughs> we end up going to a restaurant that's called Red Rooster. It was so good y'all when i tell y'all it was good it was good okay i end up getting the chicken and waffles with a side of um collard greens and macaroni and cheese together very different but when i tell y'all it was a1 and they had breadcrumbs on top it was so good look at me eating this like it was different and I enjoyed every bit of it. It was so good. And then the chicken was also good. It was cooked like hard, like crunching, but it was not dry or nothing. And it was served with like a little of a buffalo sauce that all you had to do just like tap it a little bit. And that was just like enough for me. But it was super good. The waffle, oh my Lord, y'all. I could go, I could go to this place right now. I, I wish we had one. <laughs> The waffle was so soft with maple syrup. I really enjoyed this meal. I think this was like the best meal I enjoyed being in New York, but I did not have enough days to explore other foods. But this was like really, really good. I rate this restaurant a 10 all day long. I'm telling the waitress like this is super, super good. So after we left here, we actually stopped by Starbucks. Y'all, in New York, it's like a Starbucks on every corner. Every corner. And then here we go. Keisha stays on her phone, y'all. That's why her phone is always dead. She stays on her phone. And yes, I got 10 pumps of vanilla. I like it sweet, y'all. So this man right here, he has no legs and he was in a wheelchair. So I'm like, how he's going to go down these stairs? I literally, I was like, oh no, I got to film this. But he was actually picking up something off the ground. And I'm like, okay, he's not going down there because, listen, he must have some tricks. But he didn't. Then the paramedic brought a man from downstairs. On I was like, it's so much going on in New York. You just, like, never know what is going on, okay? Now, I'm going to tell y'all, New York got a lot of CVSs, too. Anyways... What we end up doing next? Oh, we went to Central Park. Central Park is so beautiful. This is us. No, I did not have any boots, y'all. I didn't want to purchase no boots. I don't wear no boots in Florida. So listen, dunks it was, okay? This is Keisha. You know, Keisha got a pose. 
um this is me right here it was so cold y'all oh my lord it was cold in new york this was the subway it was so packed so packed we went to canal street let's talk about canal street y'all hustlers okay canal street is like i got a special price for you i got a special price for you and they be like this right here um thirty dollars i'd be like 15 they be like no 30 30 okay mommy mommy 25 25 i'm like no 15 listen you can't hustle a hustler so this man right here listen i did not um know that a lot of agents actually live in new york i didn't i promise you i did not know that so this was a nice man but let me tell y'all something they were selling like knockoff louis vuittons and michael kors bags and basically he asking the lady to come here so he has a piece of like laminated paper in his hand and he's just like um they open up the paper and basically you pick what purse that you want and um once you pick the purse they give you a price so she tells me it's 120 dollars and i go 120 dollars hey tommy i said 120 dollars i said oh no listen she didn't think twice about leaving she asked me not to record her it was so funny to me i'm like Y'all just hustling illegal, Lord. Anyways, Chinatown we was. So, to be honest, I mean, it's hustlers. I like it. If y'all know anything about me, I love when people hustle. They trying to get their coins up. Anyways, we went to an Asian bakery. I did not personally get anything, but um, Tommy and Keisha did, and they enjoyed it. This bakery must was A1 because when we walked in, it was packed to the fullest. Look how many people there. Look, Pat. And they waited patiently in line. I sat down. Then we went to Joe's Pizza. Joe's Pizza was good. I rated about an eight. It was really hot. I enjoyed every bit of it. I only got one slice. Then we got a hot dog off this food truck. This hot dog was banging, y'all. I could. I, I ate so much Saturday. Like, by the time I got to the hotel, I was full. By New York, I enjoyed every bit of it. I want to visit a different part of New York. New York is different than Florida, I'm going to tell you. So beautiful. Bye, y'all. Don't forget to subscribe.